<laughs> okay, hello everyone and welcome back. In this episode we are going to adventure through the swamps and try to find some swamp dungeons. In the last episode we built this tree house and after recording I finished it a little bit. I didn't get to build these stairs as I wanted them. Like, I will fix this and yeah, there is a lot to fix about this. Like, the door, first of all, will be flipped the other way around. There we go. So now it opens like this. Also, I want to make a guardrail on this so I don't fall again. Is there a way to prevent the mobs from spawning? Because the Great War spawning 24-7 on our doorstep is kind of annoying. All right, there we go. Now we have a railing at least on the outer side. Oh yeah, bed needs a nearby fire. Well, that is a problem when we have a tree house. Hmm. I will fix all of my gear and we will be heading straight into the swamps. Leeches, okay. Well, I don't want to fight against leeches, thank you. But the leeches want to fight against me, okay. Well, take this. Ooh, hello. This place is not really friendly. One oh, leech, nice. What do we get from the leeches? Blood bag. Lovely. Oh, there are Kroggers and skeletons here. Ah. I did not expect to see you skeletons over here as well. Oh. That's kind of nice to see you here. I feel at home now. Except there are a lot. Oh, there are Kroger bowmen as well. Oh. I will clear out the skeletons with this. Ooh. Hey, 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 I'm stunned. I'm solo HP. Ooh. Okay. Damn, the swamps are no joke. We have just barely stepped into the swamps and I'm already struggling. This will not be good. Ooh, there are a lot of leeches here. Well. Yeah. Leeches are no problem because, yeah, I can just shoot them with the bow, and um, they're pretty chill. Leech trophy. Who's making that sound? You? The leeches poison me, okay, that's good to know. Oh, I'm actually dying to the poison, damn, hey, 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 I have 4 HP, ooh. This place, holy shit. Am I geared enough for this place? Is the bronze armor what I'm supposed to wear into here? I'm not even sure. But I don't think we can make any other armor yet. I'll take down one of the ancient trees. Let's see. Oh, hello Draugr. Oh, two Draugrs. I did not want to fight against you guys. Solo HP. No, no, it's a star one. But hey, we have our trusty stone here. Like in the last episode, come on, Draugrs. Come on, then. Oof. Okay. There we go, Draugr trophy. Where did the other Draugr go, though? No idea. I think I should create some better food before going to the swamps, because they are beating my ass so hard right now and I have never done any cooking in this game so I'm not sure how that works but we'll learn. I remember that we unlocked a cauldron or something. Ooh, we have a cart as well but where is it? Fermenter? Okay there it is, cauldron. I need tin for it. Okay not too bad. There we go. We have a cauldron and we can make pork jerky and ooh a lot of things. Green jam. Okay. You need a lit fire. Oh, okay. So I need to build it on top of this. Sorry. There we go. What can we make? Oh, this is what the pistols are used for. Frost resistance. The swamp creature is poisoned to me. So poison resist would be really nice. Hmm. Needs to be fermented. Oh, okay. So that is what the fermenting barrel is for. I've never done this before, so yeah. Meat base, tasty. Okay, well, 
Now we need to get some food going. Oh shit. Damn, I almost died by falling down into our own mold. Need to be careful. <laughs> okay, well, in this case, this episode just became a farming simulator. I will try and build a farm for us, so we can farm all the ingredients that we need for the soups, etc. I just gathered all of our food ingredients over here, and we can at least make some queen jam. Oh, so, sure. Let's make that. There we go. We have our first food done. What? Huh? Excuse me? Is it... What? Is it one use only? What happened? Well, I got all of this stuff back. Except the wood. So, there we go. Hmm. That was weird. Upgrade? Can we upgrade our food on this? Okay. The cooking is weird. Bronze and resin. We should have that. Five bronze. There we go. Some resin out of somewhere. The fermenter is huge. Empty and too exposed. Oh, okay. So it needs to be covered as well. Hmm. I should really make an actual base for all of this stuff. Shouldn't I? Hmm. Because this is starting to cause some problems now. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that roof is protecting the fermenter. But we don't have any bases or anything. Actually, we could make the tasty base. We just need these, these, and honey. We could make a minor stamina as well. Okay, sure. I'll make the tasty and minor stamina. 80 stamina. Damn. And there we go. We have our first thing fermenting in there. I wanted to make a blacksmith building right here, but I think I will actually make us a real base that we can have all the crafting stuff inside there. Because the village is fun and all, but we actually need a base for ourselves. Not sure if I like this or not. I'm a bit annoyed by the floor because what is this one little gap over here? Hmm. I constructed it okay in my opinion but okay let's go check how's our fermenting going is it ready it base minor stamina fermenting still these take a long time to be ready i might need to make a lot of these i checked the cultivator and we cannot plant any berries but at least we will have some carrots coming so that's something we technically have a farm now this is not the placement that i wanted this whole place is kind of crumbling apart. Minor stamina done. Oh. Oh. We got a lot of mead from that. Okay. Regenerate stamina fast. 80 stamina. So these are pretty much like stamina potions, but... Where did I put... Oh, yeah. Over here. There we go. We'll make the tasty meads as well. Hmm. I kind of like that. It gives me like log cabin vibes. I might do the walls like this, but this will be expensive as hell. I think I might go with circular staircase, because I was planning this corner to be our crafting area, but then I wanted to make stairs like this, but I don't want the stairs to be limiting our crafting area. So I might just build a pillar in the middle over here and build a spiral staircase around it. Okay, I got those stairs correctly, but this one doesn't want to snap right. Or like that. Yeah, okay. And now we can hide all the crimes under the floor. Like, no one has to know about what's underneath there. Okay, there we go. Now we have a circular staircase into our second floor. It is not quite perfect. But it is good enough. I will be continuing this build in the next episode and I hope you guys have enjoyed this. And if you did, please leave a like and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!